Hey everyone, I am Arlena Gafford, an Avon Gold Leader and Honor Society member. And tonight I wanted to come out and share a couple um, answers to your questions. I am getting a lot of questions about how do we get paid with Avon. And Avon pays us a couple different ways based on how we have it set up and based on how they have it set up. So first we're going to cover um, our sales. So when you sell orders, products in person, I'm going to show you the way that you can figure it up for every order. And we do have our order books. So if you do not have these, you can order them from Avon for free. So I highly suggest you get them, learn how to use them, unless you want to use the online invoicing system. And I really um, kind of suggest using both so you get a great idea on how uh, to earn, that was my dog, <laughs> but how you earn on what you sell. So first, here is one of the benefits that you can do when you have your order book. Um, you can have your order book with your goals on it. So how much are you looking to earn? How much are you looking to sell? And what are you using that money for? So this is campaign 16, $200 earnings to pay for food and goodies at Rep Fest. So um, I am getting ready to go off to Avon's Rep Fest and I have a lot of meals earned already, but we still need to eat the rest of the time. So, um, and then I always like to shop at the Avon store. So what are you looking for? What are you using the earnings for? So write that on the cover of your book. Okay, so call Avon and ask for um, order book like this. These are free, so make sure you get the free ones. So you'll see it's going to look um, like this or very similar to this. So they maybe have changed a couple little things on the front, but it's going to look the same. So um, get those ordered, and you can um, also, again, get free shipping when you're only ordering business supplies. So do that or find them in your sales tool section when you're placing your order, okay? So next, now you want to write the name on here. So I use my order books a little bit different. Again, I print my invoices. So I print my invoice and I also um, use the order book. So I don't use the order book where I have the carbon um, copy inside to tear off the slips. But I'm also, um, so I just write them individually, okay? So I write my customer's name. I will put their phone number if it's a new customer, um, just to kind of make sure I remember it. A lot of my customers are in my phone, so it's very easy to um, call them. Um, I will also put where they work. So I do that a lot, and then I put the campaign number, okay? You will see this says 75 cents here for their processing fee. This helps us cover costs for shipping and business supplies, and you know, just kind of, it determines and depends on how many customers you have, how much of that 75 cents you're going to um, have as you collect, okay? Um, so let's go through, and I'm going to show you. Here is one order. So I really want to go through a couple things, okay? So um, as an Avon representative, anything that has an icon like clothes, shoes, handbags, household um, decor, we earn 20% or if you're in Presence Club or higher, the PRP program, you earn 25%. So as you see, Linda bought a pair of shoes, size 10. So you can put the page number if, and this is a campaign 10 order slip. I did this so you can kind of see everything that I've done. But um, so one, I put her name up top. You can put whatever you need there for her, the campaign you're ordering out of. Um, and then if they order, say out of campaign nine or um, eight, then I would put that over here. So then, I would know which book I need to order those shoes from. So the quantity, you can put page, um, product number, a description so you'll know what it is, how much per um, product or products are. Then you put that total here. So you add up all of their products and I'll show you one that has more products in a second. 
but you'll add up her subtitle. So subtitle for her is $29.99. At the time, I charged my customers a dollar processing fee, but Avon has up our um, shipping just a little bit. So now I charge a dollar fifty. So I would suggest charging $0.75, cents, a dollar, dollar twenty-five, or a dollar fifty. Um, that's just your choice. But I charge at that time um, my customers a dollar, and then the total. The subtotal plus the processing fee is um, $30.99. Then you do tax where you live. I live um, in Springville and we have 10% tax. Um, next to me, Pinson, I think has like 8% or 6%. It's different from my tax, but I still charge my customers 10% because Avon is charging me 10%. So charge your customers whatever you pay to Avon, okay? Check your invoice. If you're not sure, it is on your invoice. Um, so just look there, it will tell you the percent. So 10% and then I add my total with my local tax and that gives me my amount due to collect from her. So she's going to pay me $34, okay? So that would be fun to show you a couple things, okay? So I brought out Monopoly money. So we're gonna do this a little bit different. I really want you to see what you would collect, okay? So we are collecting, and for sake, we just won't do change, of course. So I am collecting $34 from her, okay? So $34.09. Now, again, 20%, if you're not in Presence Club, you're going to earn off of those shoes. If you are in Presence Club or higher, you're gonna earn 25%. So on this order, I am Honor Society. So I'm in the PRP program, I earn 25%. So I really suggest you doing this for your first few orders to really get an idea of how much you're earning off of each person and then how much you are spending yourself as well, okay? So um, we'll go through business supplies and personal order in just a second. So, $7.50 is what I am keeping from this order from those products. So see this money here? So I will get change so I can show you what we do, okay? So there's my, again, whoops, my $34, okay? But I'm keeping $5, and again, just for my sake, just bear with me. So I'm pulling $7 out. $7 is my profit. And here is the rest of it. That's $27. But remember that um, processing fee is mine as well. Okay. So you can do this one of two ways. You can say that processing fee is yours to keep, or you can um, leave the processing fee in with your Avon money, but I pull it out. So that's my dollar as well. So I am only paying Avon $26, but I'm keeping $8. Okay, and again, it's 50 cents, of course, we would pull and do, but I hope that makes a little bit more sense. So on Linda's order, I made $8.50. I'm giving Avon $25.59. Okay, so this is your in-person sales that you really want to make sure that you have. Now, what about a bigger order? This is where it gets um, a lot of fun. So let's go through, here's a bigger one. Okay. So um, this customer placed a bigger order. So her order is um, $49. So let me pull out $50. And again, just for math's sake, everyone. <laughs> so we will do a couple tens to make sure that we get what we need. Oops, we'll do that there. So it is just $50. Okay, so we're going to, all right, so 20, 40, 45, and five ones, okay? All right, so on um, Winona's order, if you look, she had products that are full earnings, okay? So your bath products, your spirit, your jewelry, your makeup line, skincare line, all of those are full earnings. And again, these pictures are when I was in row circle um, for this one, okay? So my earnings in that 
for that whole year and the year after was 45% on items that did not have an icon, so our full core products. So the Blue Escape Cologne, it was $11, but I made $4.95. Black Suede, $11.495, um, and it just goes on, okay? So um, I know it's a little bit messy, but it's just how I write my stuff. So um, this is one reason why I write it, and then I print it for my customers. But um, I do this so I know how much money I'm earning. So on here, you can see that when I added up all of her order, it comes to $44.12. Again, the dollar processing fee, um, which makes it $45.12. Local tax, 10%, $4.51. And the amount due is $49.63. And again, just for math's sake, and we're playing with Monopoly money at the moment, um, we have $50, okay? Now, when I pull all of my earnings, I earn $19.86. So we're gonna say 20, okay? And I pull my processing fee, which is a dollar. So now I have $21, $20.86, and then I'm giving Avon $28.77. So with this, I put this in my pocket and I pay Avon this much for those for this order. Okay. Now let's pretend Winona, um, her order was my order. It was a personal order. Then I would figure this up the exact same way that I just did here. But the difference is I would still do the discount, but instead of me paying Avon, you know, like the customer paying um, $50 in. Sorry, my eyes bother me a little bit. <laughs> so instead of um, myself paying $50 to myself, you can do that if that's what you want to do. Um, but instead, I would pay Avon the discounted price. So I would figure this up and I would go, okay, so I am placing a $50 order with Avon, but I only have to pay, excuse me, $28.77. So with this, it's only $28.77 that I'm giving Avon for a $50 order. Do y'all see that? So I have all kinds of goodies that I'm purchasing for myself and I'm getting a discount. So the more you sell, the higher you sell, the more you get in Presence Club and Honor Society and Rose Circle. David H. McConnell is um, another level. We have Presence Council and Inner Circle. So definitely look at those levels and go for it because the more you sell, the bigger the discount. So say I actually, Say I sold over $1,600, then I would have 50% off. So I wouldn't pay as much. Get the point? So I would pay half price, then just the tax, okay? I wouldn't pay processing fee because it's my order. I don't have to pay that to myself. So, um, but for this order with 45% discount, I would pay Avon $28.77 instead of $49.63. So this is really what you want to look at. Now, there are two other ways that you can earn um, off of your sales. So um, on our online orders, when you have customers who place their online order with you at your e-store, and I wanna see if I can maybe bring up my website for you. So when you're on web office, over here on the right side, it's going to let you know if you have any direct delivery orders, and I do. <laughs> so let's see if I can do this, because I really don't want people's information out. So let's see how I can play with this, okay? So let me stop share for just a second so I can see how I can do this, um, because I really want you to know what this is. Um, without, like I said, just a little bit of security um, reasons. So let's see, let's see. How can we do this? Ooh, we're gonna get real big, I don't know. It might not work on that way. Okay, so let's just go back. Okay, so on here, let me go back to sharing my screen for all of you. So hopefully you like to see me for just a second. <laughs> Um, share. Yes. 
Okay, share screen. Okay, so um, as you can see, I have online orders and it's going to let you know what your online orders are. Okay, so that's one. And then I wanna show you, so let's just see if I can pull up a couple things, okay? So we're gonna go, and this is your Avon 2.0. Um, so yay on it, learning um, as we go as well. So you can click on my account and you're going to see, oh, let's, okay, so let's scroll down, let's do a search, let's find online credit. Okay, so here, right here, um, and this is how I have mine set up, but you can have yours again set up a different way. So I don't have mine set up um, for direct deposit because I still place a good chunk of my orders at my um, representative site. So I can just do it here. But if you have where you know you're gonna sell a ton online and you want it direct deposit or you just want it direct deposit in general, you can. So first and the 15th is what we know it might change. So definitely call Avon and ask if you're not sure about direct deposit. But when I have a um, customer place an order online, then I'm going to, um, in a couple of days, and depending on you know when it ships and little details like that, but in a couple of days, I will see an online store order earnings credit, and it's going to show $10.10 or, you know, whatever it is um, for you. So you're going to see that on your account statement, and you will even see this on your account statement when you are, um, when you have um, direct deposit, and then they'll pull it from here and put it into your account. So you can have direct deposit, or you can have, um, just let it, if you do absolutely nothing, it's going to apply to your Avon account. So, um, just know that. And then for your leadership, leadership will work two ways. Okay. So when you are on this page, you want to really look at how you can work your business. What do you want it to be? Um, so on here, let's see if I can scroll down so you can see. moving a few things. <laughs> so when you're on here, you can have your earnings um, summary um, widget on Bob. You can also have the leadership earnings statement. You can go to it and look at that. But when you're on here, um, it's going to show you what you're earning and what different areas you're earning from, okay? So when you're looking at this, you really want to, um, again, it's going to be Leadership earnings will be paid to one of two ways. So either they will direct deposit into your account if you have that set up, or if you don't set that up, then they're going to send you a prepaid card and they're going to um, put your money that you earn off of your team on there. So I want to pull one thing. Let's see if I can pull it so you can see what the, um, let's see if I can find it real quick. I want to show you the new, um, the leadership chart, just in case you don't know where that is. Uh, see the old one? Oh, I know what I put it at. Okay. Um, I say I do. <laughs> we'll see if I do. Yes. Okay. So when you are on this leadership comp plan, we earn different ways, okay? So say you are a promoter, um, you're going to earn, you can earn $20 off of your qualified new recruits that are representative to place a $150 order in their first or second order, and they pay for it on time. Um, you also earn a 3% off of what they sell. So if they sell $200, then you're gonna earn 3% off of um, what they pay into Avon. And just know as you are recruiting and recruiting and helping them earn money, it's all gonna come together. I will help you along the way. Um, again, if you're a star promoter, you'll earn $20 again on any qualified new recruits, first or second order. Not only do they need to pay, but um, place their order on time, but pay, so make sure that they pay. Um, the 3% bonus, 
off of, that's just a sponsoring bonus, but then you also get the 3% Gen 1 um, generation bonus. G1 means your first generation. So that are that's people that you personally recruit. So we'll take Amanda, for example. She's been recruiting um, and she is becoming a star promoter this campaign. But when Amanda has one of her girls, I know Laura is one of um, her ladies. So say Laura starts recruiting, well, um, Amanda will earn a Laura and we'll say Bridget. I don't know the other girl's name, but so Amanda will earn 3% um, sponsoring on Bridget and Laura, and then another 3% on um, generation bonus. But then on Laura's girl, um, Susan, she's not going to earn um, either one of these. But as she move up, you're going to earn more. So again, when Amanda is bronze ambassador, she'll earn. The $20 is always, so as you're growing your business, every time you have a successful qualified recruit, you're going to get that bonus. Your first generation, you earn this 3% on. You move up to bronze ambassador, you get a $500 bonus paid out um, over four campaigns. Your mentor, so if you are mentoring someone, then you'll get a $250 bonus paid out over four campaigns. Now, here's the difference. So now Amanda has three people on her team. In her first generation, she's not only going to earn the 3% sponsoring, but she's also going to earn the 3% first um, generation bonus. And then off of Laura's team, she's going to earn 3% as well. So as you see, the more you recruit, the more your team sells, um, the more y'all move up, the more and more earnings and how you get to everything on this chart and really start earning. So platinum is my son's goal for us is to go to platinum. Um, why not go to the top? Um, but as you are moving up, you're going to earn. And again, leadership is where you earn. Um, they will direct deposit your earnings every other week. So campaign, let's see, campaign 15, we were just paid out this past week. So always think about it as the opposite week of when our campaign ends. So when our campaign ends, Avon wants to make sure they have all their numbers correct and what our checks are supposed to be in the following week we get paid. Um, unless they change it, you know, you never know. But at this moment, it is the week um, after we close out. Um, so you'll get either a de direct deposit or you'll earn on your um prepaid Avon card. So they will send you a prepaid card for your leadership earnings if you don't set up direct deposit. And then just going back to your sales. So let's go back here. So when you are looking at this, um, you're going to keep the difference. And again, think about your business supplies. Are you spending? What if you spent $100 in um, for business supplies, but you only made $50? Well, you're in the negative of $50 because you need to pay in to Avon $50. So you always want to have more money and more orders coming in than what you're putting out. Okay. So always remember that. And you can have big orders. I wanted to show you what some big orders look like. Here are, um, as you can see, I staple um, my invoices that I print out on my customer bags. Even when I had like written out all the um, invoices and gave it to them. That way um, I would staple it because it's easier for me to um, look for their order in my car, um, especially when you have a lot of orders like this and I'll group them together based on where I'm going. So um, that's one picture. So definitely go out and sell a lot. Um, it's very doable. You can sell. There's ladies that sell way more than I do. Um, I have sold 2000 and 3000 a campaign and between a fundraiser and Christmas orders, we've sold almost 8,000 personally a campaign. Um, and but there's ladies that sell four and five, six, seven thousand every campaign, it's like nothing to them, um, because they, they just have built their business up and up and up and up, and um, that's one way that you can do it. So, really think about how much you want to grow your business and what your goal is. So, remember, order the order books from Avon and look at this 
Um, always put your goals down. How many new customers do you want? How many orders do you need? What does the average order size need to be? Um, we do have our average order at 25, but with the um, A boxes, our orders are increasing. So you can shoot for $50 average orders. It's just completely up to you. And remember, pull out, most of us have, um, I, I know it's kind of cheesy, but most of us have um, Monopoly money. So pull this out and play with it. Write out your orders exactly like I just shared with you, okay? Write it out, put your profit to the side and take your profit out and pretend this is the money you're collecting and see what you're going to do. Um, set up, okay, well, I'm going to spend $25 every campaign on my business. Um, so you know that and I mean $25 that's a hundred books hundred books going out every single campaign I promise you when you are following up with those customers and giving them new books and you consistently do this You're gonna have way more orders and that is really how I have grown um, Yes, we have online now, but a lot of people want the books in hand um, But at the same time you can just choose what you want to do you can do online brochures or you can do in-person brochures Okay, so play with your monopoly money try it out it's not going to hurt anything um figure out your orders because you can earn as much as you want so put that out there set you a plan how many people do you need to talk to to reach that and always follow up with your customers so i hope this helps you know um, how you get paid with avon you get to keep part of your profit if you did not spend it back in to your business when you have in-person sales your online orders, you get to um, have direct deposit or Avon will credit your account. And with leadership, they will direct deposit or send you an Avon prepaid card um, with your earnings on it. So always keep your card. Once you get that, do not, do not, do not throw it away. Keep it, keep it, keep it, okay? So y'all have a good night. And if you have questions, please comment in the comment section and I will definitely try my best to answer those for you. Y'all have a good evening.